Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. Uh, I am. We're playing at Madden 21. We are. Are we the Bengals? <laughs> My stupid. Don't answer that. We're playing as the Browns. <laughs> Why do you hate the Bengals so much? Because they're our rival, dude. What do you mean they're our rival? They are one of our rivals. We have three rivals. Michigan? Nope. Uh, Pittsburgh? Yep. Uh, Baltimore? Yep. And uh, and Michigan? And the Bengals. Okay. It's close. just that the Bengals are trash, just like the Browns. So when they play each other, it just looks like oh, two look. farts smacking together in the wind. <laughs> oh, I get it. But it's actually like competitive because they're both bad. Yeah, dude. It's like it's like watching. Never mind. It's like it's just watching two bad things play together. <laughs> it's so it, kind of like watching the Browns beat on the Dallas Cowboys. Yes. Kind of like that. Because the Cowboys are bad. Who do the Browns play uh, next, Jonas? They will have already played them by the time this video comes out. I mean, the we'll, Indianapolis Colts. No. And then they play the Steelers this coming, would, would be this coming week after this video comes out. All right, cool. So that's two wins right there. That's two for sure wins right Is there. Is it? They're going to be five and one? I mean, Jonas, listen. They do very poorly against uh, Pittsburgh. Oh, another interception. I've thrown a billion today. Notice that. I think they've updated the game to make me trashier. <laughs> this, this dude just danced around me like he was flipping Walter Payton. And... <laughs> All right. Well, Jonas, uh, I think you might have to start uh, stepping your game up again. Stepping your game up a little bit. Yeah, dude. I just suck. Um... <laughs> That's really it. I mean, I'm, Have you ever been to the circus? Uh, wow, Jonas. Yes. Yes. You took me back a little bit. Because, like, Ringing Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey, I believe they actually stopped doing Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey. Yeah, because they were abusing animals. I don't know if that was the reason, but probably. I mean, that well, was a part of it. they had to stop having, like, elephants and other certain animals, and then, like, they were like, well, what's the point of having the circus without the I mean, animals? I still want to see somebody walk a tightrope. I still want to see somebody, like, in, in the giant hamster wheel or the ball or whatever. I don't necessarily need to see some guy smacking a lion. That to, I mean, that's just you, though. To like, get my jollies. I mean, I kids guess. Kids don't know any better, dude. They're like, oh, animal abuse, dude? I don't. Why oh, is animal every... abuse. <laughs> I'm garbage. Yes, I am. I'm I think garbage. about, like, uh, clowns, though. Those are awful. Um, yeah. But, yeah, I've been to the circus before. I enjoy Ringling Brothers, Bart and Bailey. I went one time. Yeah. And it was okay. Is that it? That's all, that's all you I get. don't remember a lot from it. I remember I wanted to ride the elephant, and I couldn't because it cost more money. Mm. I didn't go with my mom and dad. I went with a family friend. And went with, like, another kid that was young my age, and it was a girl, and I don't know for the life of me who it was. Oh, really? Like, I don't remember. I think it was, like, another one of their friend's kids or something. Mm. But I remember what I do remember is afterwards, we went to McDonald's, and my mom had given me, like, five bucks or whatever to get a Happy Meal or whatever, you know, because I was a child. And it was back when McDonald's had cookies. And uh, I remember going... The girl I was with was like, oh, I'd like to get some cookies, but I don't have enough money. And I remember saying, that's okay. I'll buy a box of cookies, and we can share them. <gasps> The box of cookies. And like, and I remember the McDonald's lady being like, oh my God. And I think she ended up giving us both boxes of cookies because oh. that was so sweet. And then like, and the only reason I remember that is because like the lady I was with told my mom about it. And my mom was like very proud of me as like a little boy to like <laughs> offer to share my cookies with my friend or whatever. So I was like seven or something. You know what I mean? Oh, like, oh we can share cookies. That's fine. Jonas, you could have been... Uh, never mind. You could have. Uh, that could have been your girlfriend. 
that whole that cookie move, yo. <laughs> that was that was some real alpha male energy right there. Yeah, dude, I do that still to this day. <laughs> you just go and you offer me cookies. <laughs> but I take a girl to McDonald's on her date. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, look, I got you on the cookies. I'm like, look, why don't we just split a Big Mac? It'll save me some money. <laughs> Or you don't need two Big Macs, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, I'm smooth, just like I was when I was seven. Yeah, and then at the end, you whip it out. Right? Wow. No? That doesn't happen. Sexual assault, huh? <laughs> <laughs> nice way to end the date. Just pull out a little bit of assault. Non-consensual cock. I mean... <laughs> I just... It's, <laughs> it's not consensual. It's, it's, never mind. You know what? <laughs> you never know if it's going to be consensual. I mean, that's kind, I'm of just saying. it's kind of the reason why you ask first, dude. You don't just do it. Oh, uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, but it's mine. Never mind. You're all right, Joe. Fine, Joe. It's fine. Fine. I mean, there's laws in place for a reason. Fine. It's mine, you say. <laughs> all right. But Jonas, it's mine. That was, that was, that was very touching, Are you talking Jonas. about your parts or hers? All right. Which the, part are you in? So the circus. <laughs> so anyways, after I was a saint... <laughs> Do you remember the on ice uh, craze? Like Disney on ice. Uh, yeah, that was still going on before pandemic. Turtles on ice. Do they still they still had oh, on F, ice? Yeah, dude. They do like Disney Disney on ice is like a big effing deal. I didn't know that still happened. Well, I mean not now because of COVID. <clears throat> I actually had like a a book. I don't know if if I still have it to this day, I might. But it had like it was the Thundercats on ice. Oh, dude, it was like a storybook? No, it was just like a picture book of like all the actors on ice and like uh, they were all dressed up in cosplay. Aww. It was like good cosplay though, but it was just on ice. They're happy, dude. They scored. Yeah, dude. It is. That's what yeah. I look like after scoring got to pump up jam a little bit yeah dude i was a thun i used to i used to love the like thundercats toys when you were a kid because it came with that little ring and you put the battery in it and you put it in their back and their eyes would light up mm. and it was like and they all had the same thing so you had like 96 little parts mm. oh did you see him friend eat his effing lunch and take him to goddamn rudy's i don't know what that means Rubies. Ludies, loot. Yeah, dude, it's stupid. Nudies. He won. <laughs> Take him to nudies. <laughs> God, he thought he was a big bad boy. He got shoulder checked by a man. Yeah, I don't care. I don't care for Disney. I don't either. There's like no Disney character that I'm like, yo, I need to see that right now. I like now. the original Aladdin. Uh, yeah, I guess. I don't know. I guess uh, if you're talking like Marvel, yeah, I'm going to go see. Okay, look, that doesn't count, though. That's Marvel. Yeah, right? that's not Disney. Yeah, Anything dude. Marvel, I'm going to be like, you I need that in my life. You know what's oddly funny? What's that? Is I, like, as far as, like, when, when it comes to, like, music, like, I pretty much will listen to anything if someone else puts it on. Like, if I'm with you and you put on death metal, I can listen to death metal. I can listen to country. Would I ever put either of those on probably by myself? There's, you know, no, maybe not. But if someone starts playing Disney music, that's the one thing I'll be like, can you turn that off, please? So I have asked numerous people to turn off Disney music. That's the only thing. That Who get... puts Disney music on in the car, though? You'd be surprised, dude. Really? People like that stuff, dude. Disney music. Like, yep. I just can't wait to be king and just... Yeah, but, like, some of, like, the newer ones have, like, God... Let it go. Let it go. Yeah, dude, I just can't do it, man. Like... Wow. Mm -mm. I mean... All right, so, look, you know, I'm, I'm definitely a man-child, so I understand, like, you know, having an affinity for things that you used to appreciate as, as a kid. All right? I get that. But, like... I don't know, man. Feel like you. You remember like when girls used to wear like the Tweety Bird shirts? They were like adult Tweety Bird, though. Some some still do. <laughs> there's a certain type of woman that wears a Tweety yeah, Bird. Shirt. There's a certain type of woman that wears a Tweety Bird shirt. A certain type of woman that wears the Eeyore shirt. Oh yeah, they're yeah, yeah. Eeyore I feel like fans. They're, they're kind of the same woman. <laughs> that, I mean, they are, but they're two sides of a, the coin. I think. But yeah. yeah, there's a lot of crossover there. Yeah, yeah. There's yeah. a blended area. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Tweety Bird riding Eeyore. That was my favorite one. 
<laughs> one of them leans a little harder into their depression than the other side. The other one leans a little bit harder into the disorders. <laughs> Stop, 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 stop. And then, uh, like, those women are completely different from the Bugs Bunny girls. Oh, yeah. The Bugs Bunny girls. Say, like, aren't, like, aren't all that bad, dude, comparably. I think Bugs Bunny's the worst of the three, the least bad of the three. Mm -hmm. But they're also the rares. Yeah, dude. Um, what, what is the Disney characters that that these uh well here's these the thing, people though. are and, I, and I get even get the nostalgia like you were talking about. Like, oh, dude, I used to love Aladdin when I was a kid. Put on, like... Street rat, dude, riffraff. But like, you're you're playing songs. <laughs> Street rat, riffraff. You're playing you're playing songs from movies that came out when you were grown. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's new, it's new, it's new Disney, it's new Aladdin, it's new. There's there's Snow grown White. grown men that I know that like Disney a lot. Yeah, it's new, it's new Snow White, it's new Aladdin, dude. I'm not mad at that. It's like, uh, I don't know, you know, some people get stuck in that whole idea of music was never as good as when I was a kid, TV was never as good as when I was a kid, and some people are like, you know what, there's some music that's still in the same genre, the stuff I listened to back then, mm -hmm. that's good, there's still some TV that's good now, so, you know, Disney. Yeah, dude. I, I get know. it, I get it, but I mean, you know, to be 40-something years old, and, you know, watching Mickey Mouse is a little, little you know, I'm, I'm just saying. Yeah, know. dude. I try sometimes. Like, I've tried to watch, like, Looney Tunes. <laughs> You've tried. You, like, To watch, like, Looney Tunes. And, like, I just can't, like, I can't get through. Like, Looney. old Looney Tunes? Yeah, like, like, I just can't get through stuff I used to watch when I was younger. Oh, like, why well, you I... stopped watching cartoons well before I ever stopped watching cartoons as well. Yeah, so. like, it's not even the fact that it was a cartoon because, like, I don't know, like, I don't know, dude. I just, like... Maybe I just hate everything. I think you don't really like watching stuff. Like, I, I think you, I say to people 95% of the time, people be like, yeah, if you want to watch some TV or something, I tell people all the time, I don't watch TV. But then again, I watch YouTube probably like, or at least like have it on the majority of the day. Yeah, and I really don't watch a lot of stuff. You really don't, but you, you read a lot more. Yeah. Yeah. I read. I mean, a lot of it's articles. Like, I, I, can't, I can't. I struggle with reading books. Yeah, I wouldn't read a fiction. I, I absolutely have no desire to read fiction. Yeah, no like, desire whatsoever. It, and like, it, and here's the thing: if it's about a, if, if if it's a good story, I can really get into a book. But if it if it gets dull for like ten pages, I'm out. I'm yeah. like, I'm like, dude, I lost interest. I can't. I just can't read BS I don't care about. I just don't like reading the same line ten times just to understand it. Yeah, and like, and that's the thing with like reading like articles. It's like, it's a lot of it's like, well, most of it's somewhat factual, and it's short it's to the point. It's like, here's what happened. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, that's relevant. That's fair. <laughs> so yeah, you you watch less TV than I do, and that you know that's that's a little nuts. I know I can't I can't even count the number of times that I've walked that you've walked out of your room and I've been in the living room with nothing on, just on my phone reading stuff, and you're like, "What yeah. are you doing?" And I'm just or like, you will have the TV on and totally not be paying attention to it. Yeah, background noise. Like I'll you put have, the office on on loop. Just you'll have, to have the background TV, noise on. You'll have the TV on, and then you'll be doing something on your computer or doing something on your phone. Yep. Yeah. What happened in this episode? Nah, I, yeah, like, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, in my defense, I don't know half the stuff that happens most of the time. Like, we get done with an episode, and we have to, like, listen to it to remember what we talked about. Because I don't know why. We're old and that see now. Yeah, I still, I still enjoy shows, though. I will actually sit down and enjoy a show. Depending on what it is, and if a new show comes out and I hear good things about it, I'll, I'll, give it, I'll try to give it a shot. Um, yeah, every so often I do get into some new stuff, but it, it's it's very rare. Yeah, like I still watch uh, I still watch My Hero Academia. I still watch Naruto or Boruto. I think that uh, what happened was like I spent so much time from like eighteen to twenty six watching stuff because I worked at Blockbuster and, and like got tons of free rentals and was a lazy POS and didn't do anything ever. Right. And like and just watched so much stuff. Then I'm just like, I think I burnt myself out on watching stuff. <laughs> I can see that. 
And I feel like for me, what made me stop watching, like at least TV, as 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 in itself, was uh, I just went like five, six years without cable, and then I was just like, well, <laughs> YouTube kind of took over after that, or actually, it was Hulu. I would watch a lot of Hulu, and I was like, well, there's half the commercials. This is great. And then YouTube didn't have nearly as many commercials as it does nowadays. And I was like, oh, well, this is even less commercials. Yeah. So now if you do turn on television and I come out here and you're, like, watching a game or something. Oh, my God. It's miserable. I won't want to watch the game. I'll be like, I want to see the commercials. It's, it's just nuts. <laughs> it's, it's like, always it's Super Bowl Sunday to me. the only time I watch live TV is during sports. And I have, like, the HD antenna to catch football. And I forget how much, like, commercials are effed up, dude. Like, I I enjoy watching commercials now. You know what I, you know what I, and we may should get into this on a later time because it might be a longer conversation, but that's fine. Like, it kind of weirds me out a little bit. Makes me, I don't know how it exactly makes me feel. But, like, I was watching a... It's amazing how quick a culture will shift to monetize the situation that you're in. Mm. Because, like, now all the commercials are, like, about, like, this and face masks and da 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 They're coming out with new shows that are about people who are isolated. And, and like, it's just, like... It's just like it's like it's just a never ending machine. They will figure oh, out a yeah, way dude. to make money off of life. Oh yeah. yeah. It, it like almost like sickens me a little bit. Like, I like equality. The next James Bond is gonna be a black woman. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like, like, and like, you, oh, you better make that a white man with a British accent right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's just it's, I said it. it it's it has just become like TV and commercials, and it's just become the. It's like, and I'm sure it's always been like this. Yeah, well, most definitely. But has. the, it's like the fakest, most like disgusting. It, it only it takes it takes for it to be an, an egregious like thing of like like kind of what's going on now. Just an egregious like just of it for you to notice it. But yeah, it, it totally has been like this for the longest time. It's always the, it's the pop train, man. Everybody jump on the pop train. If it's hip happening, happening, like think about it, Jonas. You remember the real world? Yep. Reality TV. Yeah. That was the only reality TV show. And then what happened? Now everything. Is the reality. pop train. Everything is, is re- reality TV. Exactly. I can't believe that, like... That show changed the world. world. Oh, and, and, I, and it just sucks. Like, I can't... And Well, and here's the, the thing. is like, reality TV isn't even reality. It's just somewhat yeah. reality. It's it's all fake. I think maybe, like, the first season of the real world was, like, real. Yeah, and maybe then, even the first couple. Like, yeah, yeah. until and it then really they were caught just on. Like, and then they were just like, all right, we got to spice things up. <laughs> right. You get people who are, like, c- clashing personalities and yada, yada, you know, all that sort yeah. of stuff. But it's like, but need it, you two to fight today. Yeah, it's just I don't know, dude. It's it's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm old, dude. And it was like, uh, hey, do you remember American Idol? Of course you do. Guess what? There's 17 different versions of American Idol now. Yeah, dude. there's the voice. There's the X Factor. There's <laughs> there's the mass singer. There's there's 17 different. There's America's Got Talent. Everything. Dude, it's always the hype train. It's always the hype train. What's popping? What's popping right now? Oh, everybody likes uh, uh, trains. Next show is going to be Thomas's big day. <laughs> That's my favorite. That's my favorite too. Dude, it's just yeah, dude. Yeah, it's always been that way, my man. I know, dude. It's just like when it's something that sensitive. It's kind of weird. I get. Yeah, because, like, you know, pre, like, all the craziness going on in our world right now, it would just be like, oh, dude, everybody loves tigers. Let's make a tiger show. And then now it's like. (laughs) I can't wait for Nick Cage, dude. Yeah, dude. And, like, then it's like. Everybody likes tigers. Yeah. F, dude. Oh, that worked out all right. (laughs) Um, Yeah, dude. It's just. I don't know. (laughs) I just can't. You don't like it? I, I just don't. There's a lot, of, a lot of things I don't like. 
<laughs> well, tell me, tell me what, John. Tell me one thing that you do like. What do you like, John? I don't know anymore. No, no. no. I don't know, dude. I like uh, I like a lot of things I can't do right now, dude. I went, <clears throat> I went over this dude's house, dude, and he had a dog, and he had. Like two cats, yeah. and I got to pet a kitten for like a good forty-five minutes, and it was the most amazing time in my life I've ever had. Really? It was so nice to p- nice to pet a kitten. I'm glad you got to play with a cat, dude. Uh, dude, you know, it was so great, dude. So I like kittens. All right, beat that. With a stick, not the kitten. Beat the, the fact that I like beating. I mean, I like petting cats. I don't like beating I cats. I understand. Nobody wants to beat cats. But uh, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you've done that. This dude just switch. TNT Dynamite on Twitch every single day. 10 o'clock a.m. Central. That's TNT DINO on my GHT underscore crazy town. Twitch.tv. Yes, sir. For Jonas. TNT. Uh, we'll catch you on the next one. We are uh, Uta.